Hi guys, I am here in my very messy office. We tried to clean up a few things, but that's not the easiest thing to do. Um, I am going to spend four weeks with you talking a little bit about the Wilkins Way, a little bit about Karen, and a little bit about what the fuss is about. We've grown so much so quickly, and it's always been my intent that people would know me well, but I'm a little bit in the back shadows a lot these days and I want to make sure you know who we are, where I came from, what my intent is, and where we're going. So today we're going to talk about where we began and then we're going to talk about um, the foundation. We have some foundational beliefs that we never want to get away, away from. I'm going to let you guys keep me accountable if you ever see that I've gotten away from this foundational belief system that we built this business on. Call me out. I'm, I'm, I'm ready for it. And um, then we're going to talk about how, once we decided what our foundation was, how we're going to live that out, and then where we are now and where we're going. That's what we're going to talk about over the next four weeks. But today, we're going to talk about how this whole thing started. A little over seven years ago, my family, I have five kids, my family was packing to go on a vacation to St. Petersburg on a Sunday. We were going... I think it was Monday through Thursday over to our favorite little place that's on the bay but across the street from the ocean and we were going to spend a few days there. It was over the summer and I get a phone call from a friend in Tallahassee that said, hey, I need a, I'm moving to Orlando. I need a realtor. Can you, um, can you refer someone to me? So I did and then I got off the phone and I looked at my husband. I'm like, do you know how often I do that? I believe I can get a referral fee for that or something. And then I sat there in my bedroom and I thought, I have been pregnant or nursing for 20 years. I need to do something for myself. I want to do something that's fun. I want to apply a little different part of my brain than what, it's, what I've been doing. So the ages of my kids were 2 to 12 at the time, and there were five of them. And bless my husband's heart, I decided that he was going on vacation with five kids alone, and I was going to go get my real estate license because there was a class that started on Monday morning and that's about as far as I planned and I showed up at the class and I said I'm not signed up as a room can I take this course and I did and I was just gonna have a hobby because so many people called me and that's really the depth of how this whole thing started and the first year I closed one house the second year I closed three the third year I closed 16 and I was like oh this is serious. Like I'm getting busy. And then it was getting into the twenties and beyond. And let me remind you, I still had five kids at home and a husband and a church plant that I was helping with. And I was homeschooling and it was, it was getting a lot, but I was living from some core beliefs, which we'll talk about next week that I think is why it just kept growing. And what ended up happening was I was, I looked, um, and my husband, I'm like, either we need to put a sign outside that says, mama's too busy to grow this business, or I've got to get help. So that's, that was where it started. It's the, the true growth started was when I was confident enough to say, I can't do this on my own. So I hired an assistant, and we'll talk about her next week. But I hired her, and she came into my bedroom, which was my office, onto my little three by two desk that overflowed onto the floor and down the whole left side of my bedroom and she started getting me organized and there's a lot more to the story but that's where we started and I can't wait to tell you more I'll talk to you next week